See, the angle is everything. Oh God. <laughs> Welcome to Beauty Lab, where we've been busy testing the latest and greatest skincare, hair care and makeup. Click to subscribe and make sure you watch them all. Today I am testing the hotly anticipated GHD Oracle. I mean, it looks like a hair waver, like one of those ones that you clamp like this and it gives you mermaid waves but um, apparently it's more of a curling tong. It is 175 pounds, so like around the same prices as the straighteners and dryers and tongs and stuff. So it's got these kind of like bumpy ridges. They give your hair a wave as you move it down your hair. I'm sure I'm gonna mess it up, even though it's meant to be the easiest thing ever, but we shall see. Hopefully it doesn't give me like big ringlets because that's not what I'm looking for for the rest of my day. I'm gonna start on this side here. So what I believe is that you clamp it down, spin it round and then pull it down. And that gives a wave. Um, so I've seen a demo video because I didn't want to go into it blind. Um, and this is what you do. So we're gonna put it like this. Then twist it to this angle. I hope this is right. And then pull it out. Oh God. Ah, it's all coming out the other side. I've done it wrong. <laughs> Terrible. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> That's not what I was expecting. I was hoping it would be like a nice wave. Um, all right, I'll try this side. So this is almost like a ringlet, um, but you can tilt it slightly more and it's supposed to give you more of a diagonal wave. Oh my God, why did that just go so badly? Vic, help me. <laughs> you try that. You're not supposed to hold it directly like that. You're supposed to hold it kind of more like that. Okay, round two, because that did not work. So I think I was holding it at the wrong angle. So we're gonna go like this, go like this. Oh God. Oh, I should have held the other end. Work. That was closer. Let's see if I can get a better finish. This is like a um, more of a diagonal wave, and then this is more of like a round curl, as you can see. I don't want to look like Goldilocks at the end of this video, so I'm going to try and continue using this method. So clamp, twist, down. Oh, I quite like that curl. That's nice. Right, this is just no. <laughs> what is this? That was that was way better. That was great. Look at that. One nice piece. I believe that GHD are going to be offering um, like education sessions with the tool when when you buy it. I'm going to try a top bit because maybe I'm starting too low down. <laughs> okay. Oh no, is that the right angle? Oh, kind of, but I paused and that's probably where there's that weird, horrible. So I might experiment and try and twist this round that way instead and see if that gives a different curl. Ooh, okay. That's more of a curl that I would, I would prefer. <laughs> we're gonna try another section. <laughs> and we're gonna go very fast. Blink and you'll miss it fast. Right, so, clamp, turn, curl. Better, that's better. See, the angle is everything. Round three. I've had to have a few timeouts. I'm getting a little stressed up in here. I give up. I actually give up. If you use a diagonal angle, it gives a really nice, like, 
loose wave and if you do a flat angle it gives quite a straight curl. I'm gonna go right to the top and then we're gonna turn it upwards and we're gonna go quite fast. <laughs> so yeah, you wanna hold it this angle instead of this angle. I look like I'm meant to be in the bloody Pointer Sisters, I don't know. Is that a band from the 70s? I think it is. So yeah, I found it. I found it quite difficult, but I think that was because uh, my hair type is quite thick and curly. Once I sort of got an idea for the angle and the knack of how to do it and the speed and the size of the pieces. So persevere, I would say. And you know, the curls that it's made, the waves are glorious. I love, love the shape of them. And yeah, just, you know, play around. And once you got it, you got it. My thoughts are that this takes a lot of practice, but yeah, I'm sure it is great once you get the hang of it, because my hair feels actually super soft, which I didn't really talk about, you don't really know, I don't really know about the ins and outs of the technology, but it feels great considering I've just put loads of heat on it. Now that I've combed that out, that's gonna stay, like that's a really nice wave, and that's a really nice wave. And I don't like my waves to be super uniformed anyway, so. I was maybe a bit harsh on it, but yeah, it looks a bit better now that I've kind of brushed that through. So my final thoughts about the GHD Oracle are that it takes a lot of practice. Luckily, GHD are offering education um, lessons with this when you buy it, so you get um, a trial with it with um, a professional and then they can show you how to use it correctly because yeah, it's all about skill with this one. I really like the finish. It just takes practice. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to subscribe to Cosmo UK and to watch our last video. Also, let us know in the comments what you would like us to review next.